I would like to introduce you to Ronald. Nice to meet you. Guaranteed to blow you away. Aha! I can't wait to hear it. Today is a very, very special day because our collab with Darman is finally out. Fun fact, we were actually on set for 30 hours filming this because we were actually Darman's very first full YouTube collab. We all put a lot of hard work in this video and we're super excited to be watching this for the first time with you guys. Before we actually watch the video, we're gonna be flying one of you guys out to hang out with us for an entire day and be in a whole YouTube video. And all you guys have to do is be subscribed, like this video, and comment down done when you're done. Rene Descartes. Oh, hey, Fred. Come say hello. Hey, everybody. It's nice to meet you guys. Fred is our newest janitor here. My mother taught me to always treat the janitor with the same respect as you would the CEO. Anyways, Rene Descartes is best known for creating which mathematical technique? How about Roy? Uh, hello. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Tell me which math did Descartes create? Uh... It was in last night's reading assignment. You did do your homework, right? Yeah. Great. Then tell me about Descartes. Um... Could you, could you actually give me a quick second? I'll be, I'll be right back. Uh, oh, okay. By the way, guys, remember that janitor? That's actually Tanner. <laughs> run, run, I need you now, please. Why, what for? Look, you still remember everything from philosophy last semester, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect, switch with me, switch. What? What are you talking about? Just put this on. I need you to answer a question for me. I'll, I'll explain everything later. The professor's already waiting. Okay. Hurry, hurry. Come on. Okay. Perfect. What about my hair? Shoot. Oh, right here. Oh, put this on. Come on. Okay, okay, okay go. Okay, Come on. Gosh. Sorry about that. Nice hat. So, tell me about how Rene Descartes invented calculus. Uh, I can't. And why is that? Because Descartes didn't invent calculus. Gottfried Leibniz did. Descartes invented analytical geometry. That's correct. You did do your reading. Good job, Roy. Okay, everyone, that's it for today. But before I forget, since things are starting to open up, I've decided to have our final exam in person this Friday. It's worth half your grade, so make sure you study. What's super funny is I would actually do this for him sometimes in school. The script was based off of real life events. He wasn't as smart in school and I was a little bit smarter so I would sometimes do this for him. Dude, you're a genius. Thanks. But hey, if you don't know the stuff, how are you gonna pass the final? Uh, how do you think? <laughs> All right, but you're gonna owe me big time for this one. No. What? No, I'm pretty sure that makes us even. Not even close. Hey. Come on. Hey mom. Hey mom. Hey boys. Mom, if you're watching this part, please don't get jealous that we had another mom in this video. You have to cover my shifts at work for the rest of the week. You're out of your mind, I'm not doing that. Okay, then take your own final. We both know if you don't pass, you have to take the class again this summer. <sighs> Fine, I'll do it. But I'm telling you right now, there's no way I'm wearing a tie. What are you two talking about? You better not be thinking about cheating again. It's just philosophy, mom. It's not like I'm gonna use anything I learned from that class ever again. Oh, did I tell you my company's flying us all out to Mexico for a conference? And they're letting me bring a plus one. Really? Mm -hmm. Sorry, but I'm taking that spot, Mom. I'm not worried about Mexico. What I'm worried about is dishonesty. I always tell you boys, if you cheat, then you will never get ahead. Everything's under control, Mom. <sighs> they scored on us. Yeah, but that wouldn't have happened if you were playing goalie like you were supposed to. <laughs> That's Sean! He's in the video! Ronald! Sorry, I didn't even see you there. You changed your hair. Looks good. But what are you doing here? What do you mean? This isn't your office. Did you forget you swapped with Timothy last week? <laughs> oh, yeah, of course, duh. It must have been like a muscle memory thing. Oops, I'm sorry. That, that's the entry. Oh, go ahead. Okay, okay, I'll 
I'll just go to my office. My office. Ronald! Y yes. This is your office? Oh, uh, yeah, of course. Sorry about that. Why didn't you tell me where your office was? You almost got me in trouble! Don't forget, tomorrow at 1 is the big presentation. We've got a lot at stake here. Presentation? Are you feeling okay? Because you have been acting a little strange. Yeah, of course. I, I just didn't get much sleep last night. Uh-huh. Well, you make sure you sleep tonight, because we can't afford a mess up. That would be really bad. <sighs> of course. You have a presentation tomorrow? When were you planning on telling me this? <sighs> Shoot, I forgot about that. Hey, it's fine. I'll go in tomorrow. I'll know what to say. How, Ron? My finals tomorrow, at the exact same time. You know what? Don't worry about it. Timothy's leading the presentation anyway. Are you sure? What if they start asking me questions? I'm not gonna know what to say. They won't. Timothy and I have been prepping this for months. He's got this. All right. Fine. Should we pack our bags? Our flight's tomorrow night. That's a good idea. Just like that, we're done arguing. <laughs> oh, Roy. Are you hiding something? What? No, why would you say that? Because you look like you're wearing a disguise. <laughs> Take your hood off, please. Glasses, too. There's something different about you. There is. Yeah. Take off your hat. Aha! Look, I'm sorry. You see... You changed your hair. I knew there was something different about you. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's it. And it looks good on you. Well, here's your test. Good luck, Roy. Okay, who wears sunglasses in a classroom? I was trying to cover up the mold. Where are you going? Where, where, where's Timothy going? I... Uh... Ah! Ronald, there you are. Oh my gosh, you are not gonna believe what happened. Timothy ate some bad oysters last night. He did? Yeah. Oh, uh, so I'm gonna need you to lead the presentation today. Me? What? That's not a good idea. Why not? You were with Timothy when you did all the research, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Great, you'll be fine then. Oh, there's our client now. Ah, oh, Samir, thank you so much for coming. Of course. I would like to introduce you to Ronald. Nice to meet you. Ronald is one of our most brilliant minds. Uh, he's been preparing for this presentation for months. I, I have? Yeah. <laughs> Guaranteed to blow you away. I am? <laughs> I can't wait to hear it. Right this way. Okay. It's about to go down. <laughs> the worst possible outcome just happened to Alan. Also, in case you guys didn't notice, the receptionist was Kat. All done? Yep. Wait. Why'd you sign your name as Ronald? Uh, I did? Yes, you did. I mean, uh, I, I mean, if, uh... I know what you did. You do? Yes, it's obvious. You were thinking about your twin brother, so you accidentally signed his name. I get names mixed up all the time. Oh, yeah, that's it. That is not the smartest teacher, because he actually did that one time when he was copying one of my group projects. He copied it so much that he wrote my name down as his name. She literally called us to the front of the class. She was, hey, Alex, I can't tell whose paper is whose. Both of these is Alan's name on it. Anyways, see ya. Hold on, Roy. You forgot to answer the final question on the test. I did? Yes. And it's a good thing I caught it, too, because it's worth 50% of your grade. What is the name of the... Janitor? Yeah. You know the one I introduced everyone to on the Zoom call last week. The name was Tanner, but not in this video. I actually forgot his name. What like, was his name? Things are about to get really heated because we're about to come home and confront each other. 
Everything all right? No. Roy's gonna kill me when he finds out. What happened? I tried to take the test and it's just... Hey man, I've got some really bad news. Me too. I got you fired from your job. You what? Timothy caught in sick. I had no idea what to say. It was so embarrassing. Well, what am I gonna do now? I needed that job. I don't know. It's not my fault. I tried to warn you. So you're blaming this on me now? This whole thing was your idea in the first place. <sighs> this sucks. What, what was your news? Oh, yeah, I, uh, failed the test. What? Half the grade was based on knowing the janitor's name. How was I supposed to know that? Fred. His name is Fred. Well, it's too late now. Guess, Guess we're, we're not, not going to Mexico anymore. It's not like I was going to be able to go anyway since I have to retake that class now. Wait, why are there three suitcases? I left plenty of food in the fridge. I'll be back in a few days. Where are you going? I'm going to Mexico. I bought a ticket to join you guys, but since you can't go, I guess I'll be going by myself. So you're just gonna leave without us? Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna ruin my vacation just because you guys messed up. I tried to tell you that if you cheat- We know, we know that you'll never get ahead. Okay now, see ya. Or should I say, hasta luego? She just is rubbing it in our faces. If we actually got caught cheating in real life, let's just say that it would have been a lot worse than that. So now for the moment of truth that everyone's dying to know, have you guys ever twin swapped to get out of work or school? <laughs> oh gosh. You know, we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fair enough. One million likes and we will talk about it. But I will say cheating will catch up to you one day and you will never get ahead if you keep cheating. That's the message from today's video actually. Also guys, if you want a chance to win two brand new Apple laptops, all you guys have to do is subscribe to our YouTube channel, subscribe to Darman's YouTube channel, and then comment down done when you're done. Let's try to get this video to 300,000 likes. And with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time. time.